brought to you by Franklin County Redneck Committee on YouTube and Hanson Mobile Advertising on Facebook. My name is Robert Hanson. I'm ready to till this up to make sure it's well preserved where it does air. What do you grow? Uh, carrots, peppers, and two different types of carrots. When you say I'm growing. I'm growing two different types of carrots and peppers. And by doing so, we got to prep the soil to where it rocks out and any other foreign objects that can hint, break, stop the plant from growing correctly. Mm -hmm. And each one will be about the size of like this, depth apart, apart but cool. we're in, in deep into the soil. No, the size of your finger now, like that, like this. Okay. So it's this far apart in yeah. each row. And each row would be like this here. You see, that's what I was telling you last year. I noticed when I did the the things, they actually I did them like from pole to pole. Mm-hmm. And it worked out pretty good. Yeah, that's what I what we're going to do is to where the roots. Now, are you going to do a row this way or this way? This way. Okay. And to where each one's got enough room to grow and. It, and to expand in growth and all. Now are you going to do one row and then wait three weeks? Or? Yeah, I'm going to wait three three weeks and do each row, row. But during each time, I have to roll t check the soil to make sure everything else too. And I'm going to add chopped up up orange peel. Citrus acid will help with the soil um, and the plants. You got to distinguish between that between the that's for the peppers, not for the carrots. Well, for the peppers, I'm going to do that to where it helps with the growth and for the insects as well. Because uh, carrots don't have or they don't you don't put uh, manure and fertilizer in with them. Oh, yeah. Well, uh, and orange peel. Mm -hmm. Now, start killing. <laughs> you just and you will come across objects in like coal. How you doing, everyone? <laughs> We're going to be putting, putting, I mean, this one, the big carrots in this one by itself. They're supposed to get longer and wider than the regular ones. And then that one, you're going to put the regular ones? Yeah. All right. We're going to put three rolls of them in there, but we're going to do it all on this one. Just the size, and nobody really knows how long and how long it's going to take. Okay. And we'll be seeing how long it takes for them to develop, weeks, months, the height, how thick, and how much soil. I how remember. Remember to tell too that you're going to only do them because, like, every three weeks you got to. Well, every three weeks in that tub there, there, in, yeah, okay. You got to replenish your crop. Replenish the crop, and we're going to reseed, we're looking to harvest the seeds from all of them, too. All right. And Come weather on. and all. So right here, that's how about how much is in this container here? To one gallon. Yeah, but right here. That's what it says. One gallon. Okay. 
and you see for yourself this is nothing but orange peel and it, with the inside of it it's got citrus acids and other building material for plants well citrus acids helps keep the insects and all away as well too and you're going to be using this in your peppers right yeah peppers and other plants as well well, it depends on what plants you always got to find out first what you can do with what plants with what you got to use and if you can't afford for stuff this is the way we're going about doing it to help out our plants as well how did you make it i took all the potato uh, orange peelings broke them up and i have an old blender i throw a little bit here a little there into it and, and turn it on and let it chop up into fine pieces. Some of it's not too fine, but it's a lot bigger, than, it's a lot smaller than what it was before. And, and what you do as well is you throw it through the, the, the where you're putting your seeds at too. Some plants that you can put with this with, and it helps. And I'm going right to here. Okay. Depth of it. Or the length. The length. In between each one. I got what you're saying. Now that has to be a foot apart. So yeah, you need this right here would be a foot apart. Each, each bar would be a foot apart. Okay. Okay, here's the thing. You see these two bars here? I'm gonna not go to one to the left. I'm going to because I might need a little bit more space and a little bit more dirt, so I'm going to go to every other bar, people. Because I do not know the circumstances to the size or what you would need. And I'm using this right here to, for a guide. And I'm going by the same depth as I did before. You need to just walk around and get that. Just do it from that pole and then walk around. Wait, not yet. <laughs> I was thinking coming from my direction. Are you doing all of it? Yeah. Okay. And yeah. You, right here is the third pole. You, right here, it's always the second pole I don't use. But I'm going to split this if I have to, to put over the top of the other. Okay. Right here. Because these are supposed to be giant carrots. Yep. Word. Real tall. Okay. I was 
into a picture, but it's on the internet. I'm sure you're going to do that. I just did your other one where you were doing that. So all you got to do is get those pictures together and make your video, and I'll stream it for you like I did the other one. See right here, right here. See how far that is? There you go. Yeah, now we're gonna do carrots. A good size ones. Okay. So I'm gonna pinch some in my hand and put in the roast. You'll see. Just put the bag in the in the thing. Don't don't dump the bag. In. There you go. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Our watchdog is loose. Oh yeah. Just do each pinch where the poles go. You don't have to do more than one. Why? Oh, yeah. Because those they gotta be they gotta be. At a distance between mm -hmm. these poles so don't you're wasting you don't do them twice but just take a pinch and sprinkle are you like literally trying to grab one seed I don't know I got like that. Okay. But I want to make sure they don't get stuck in between your fingernails. Can you reach that? Down with this one. What? Oh, no. Share, make comments. We love feedback.